also make data privacy concerns the reason that you aren't testing out custom GPTs. I've talked to a lot of people about this, and I know that the concern that all of your chats and all of your data are going back to OpenAI for future training of their models is concerning but you really need to find a way that you feel comfortable testing and learning about this technology. So here's some advice on how to still use custom GPTs even if you don't wanna share sensitive data. The first is to think of custom GPTs as a way to build a proof of concept for your idea. It is an extremely easy way to start getting experience where you control what data ChatGPT is using to answer a user's question. Then as you start playing with it, you might get ideas of a real use case that you wish you could use a custom GPT for. That's great. All you need to do is come up with fake data or anonymized data. You can even use ChatGPT itself to help you create that. Tons of people are using custom GPTs to create fake data to have kind of like a fake experience and then use that as a proof of concept to get their team to buy into making a larger investment to do something more custom and secure. But it is seriously so easy to use custom GPTs that if you're not testing them out, you are really missing out. 